the Republican slim majority in the U.S. House has been even slimmer of late, in part because a member of the Oklahoma delegation has been laid up at his home in Cheyenne. Our Washington Bureau Chief Alex Cameron spoke with Congressman Frank Lucas about his near-catastrophic run-in with a bull. The old adage about maybe part of your life flashes before your eyes in a few seconds. I was at that point. On August 4th, Congressman slash rancher Frank Lucas was attempting to load up a stray bull that had found its way onto his property to take to the sale barn. I got the bull into the trailer, but because he wasn't something I'd been, I'd raised or been around, he had a different temperament. And Lucas says the bull quickly turned and headed back out the chute before he could close the gate. So a thousand pound bull and a 250 pound guy passed each other in about a three foot wide space. That wasn't enough room. The bull's hind quarters crushed Lucas's right hip joint and pelvis, but he says it could have been worse. He was a pole, but if he hit me with his head, uh, we'd be talking about a special election now. Lucas has represented what is now Oklahoma's third district for 29 years, and he'll be able to continue in that role. He says thanks to the good work of the doctors at OU who patched him up. But he says it's been seven long weeks of not being able to put any weight on his leg and not being able to be at the Capitol. I've been watching C-SPAN at home, and I've been getting a constant stream of text messages and calls from my colleagues. The good news, Lucas says, he's been cleared to fly and will be back at work next Wednesday. But as for his work on the ranch... I won't be chasing cattle for the rest of this year, and I probably won't drive a tractor until next spring. So rehab is slow, but I will be 100%, I've been assured, by the doctors. Now, Lucas says for the next weeks and perhaps months, he'll be using a walker and a wheelchair to get around this place, but says at least he'll be here, he'll be able to vote and work on things that he and his constituents care about, things like the farm bill. And I'll have an update on that next week. In our Washington Bureau, I'm Oklahoma's own Alex Cameron.